today our focus is not so much on just having an ordinary business plan. It's about having a comprehensive business plan. A comprehensive business plan is the kind of business plan that encapsulates everything necessary to present a formidable plan for success in our business. So when I think about a comprehensive business plan, I'm really thinking about a high performance business plan. My name is Bumi Toko and I'm from Start Your Own Business Academy where we help you build high performance businesses. What I'm going to do over this uh, 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 two part series is to look at number one, the reasons why you need to have a comprehensive business plan. So if somebody uh, asks me, okay, so why do I need to have a business plan? So I'm going to give you uh, uh, three reasons here and I'm going to give you some other three reasons in, in part two. So why do you need to have a comprehensive business plan? Well, in my opinion, the first reason you need to have a plan is because a comprehensive business plan will map out the journey in detail. It would say what you hope to achieve in the first six months, what you hope to achieve in the second six months, what you hope to achieve in three years time, and what you hope to achieve in five years time maybe. It will also outline the vision of the, uh, of the business. It would take the reader from where you are to where you want to go. So basically, that business plan outlines for us in detail the journey. That's why you need one. You know, it's, it, it's, it's interesting that not many of us will leave our homes to go on a journey without going to the sat nav or googling how we're going to get there and, 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 and determining what the journey will be like and look at the options that are available. The second reason why you need a business plan is because it shows you what resources you need to make the plan succeed. Like I've said before, there are four areas to any business. Number one, the first one is the, uh, the product creation and product development. The second one is product marketing and sales. The third one is uh, product finance. The fourth one is product administration. Well, the interesting uh, part of those four areas is you wouldn't know exactly to what proportion you need each one unless you have written a plan that shows exactly the resources you need to make the plan succeed. So when you go through the process of writing a business plan, you begin to discover the resources you are going to need to make your plan successful. You know, one of the things that uh, it's truly important, especially for people who are not used to running a business. So if you're a startup business, your first time of actually running a business, you absolutely need to have a business plan because if you're coming from a creative perspective or from, a, for, or from an idea perspective, then you need to have a written down plan that helps you determine the resources you need and, the, and maps out the journey in detail. Thirdly, you need to have a business plan because it shows realistic time for success. It will show you realistic time for success. How soon will I start making a profit? How soon would I go from a turnover of X to a turnover of Y? How soon will I move from having one employee maybe or no employees at all to having 10 employees? How will I grow the business? How will I become successful financially or become successful within the market? The business plan is the tool that helps you to determine realistic time for your business success. So let me recap. On this first part, I've told you that a comprehensive business plan will map out the journey in detail. It shows, secondly, it shows you the, what resources you need to make the plan successful. And thirdly, 
it shows you the realistic time for success. When we come back in part two, I'm going to show you a little bit more of the reasons why you need to have a comprehensive business plan. My name is Bumi Toko, and I'm from StartYourOwnBusinessAcademy.com. You can send me an email or go over to our website and get a free book on how to start your own business and begin making a profit within 30 days. I'll speak to you in part two.